But hello family, how are y'all doing? Today, I am going to show all of you my top 10 cryptocurrencies for 2024. Yes, the bull run is coming and we're gonna make so much money together. But now I wanna hear from all of you, which cryptocurrencies do you hold? Leave a comment down below, okay? I wanna hear from you and if I like the project, I might buy it, I might invest in it. So leave a comment, I wanna hear from all of you. So hopefully all of you have your coins ready. Now, the first one, and before we get into it, because here are a few of them like Quant, QNT, and XRP. And I'm also gonna show you why I own USDC stablecoin, yes. But before we get into it, make sure you subscribe and smash the like button. Make sure you join us because the crypto bull run is coming and we're gonna make so much money together. Now, if you're looking for a place to keep your cryptocurrency safe, you will love this decent hardware wallet. Yes, this uses your thumbprint to get in and it has a big screen so you can actually see what you're doing on this cold hardware wallet. Now, the buttons are also very big and you can actually know what you're doing. It connects to your iPhone and your Android and this holds thousands of cryptocurrencies to keep your crypto safe. It is also extremely secure because it has a seed phrase and it uses your thumbprint to get in. So what are you waiting for? Make sure you get one using the links down below for a 33% discount or get the two pack for a 40% discount. Thousands of you already got this decent hardware wallet and if you have not yet already ordered one, what are you waiting for? You will love it as well. And now back to the video. Now, USDC, why is this my number one cryptocurrency in terms of how much I hold of it? Because it makes up to 40% of my portfolio. Yes, USDC, I'm currently in about 40% in cash because I believe if we do go down, if cryptos continue going down, because this year so far it's all been green, but what if we start going red and start going down? It's good to have USDC or some type of stable coin, so that way you can take advantage of the lower prices when they come. Now, next is Quant QNT. This is one of the smaller cryptos in terms of percentages that it makes up out of my portfolio. So as we go into today's video, the percentages, how much I hold of these cryptos will get bigger and bigger. So I showed you USDC is my number one holding, but now we're starting from smallest to biggest, okay? So Quant, QNT is sitting at around $100, and this is a really good interoperability cryptocurrency. That's why I hold Quant because it has a lot of potential. Next is XRP. XRP is also a top cryptocurrency in my portfolio because I believe it can do amazing things with money transfers and working with banks and a bunch of different use cases like CBDCs and Stellar Lumens also. This is the all time chart for all of these cryptos is one that is good in CBDCs and can make a lot of money in terms of banking relationships and money transfers. Now, Hedera HBAR is also another top cryptocurrency because this is like an Ethereum killer to me and my for what my research has showed me is that Hedera HBAR can be the next Ethereum, the next foundational layer for a bunch of different applications to build on it and Hedera HVAR has a lot of potential. Next, we have Inspect INSP and this is one of my top holdings because I got into it at a launch price of 1.5 cents, I believe, like less than 2 cents. And right now so far I've over 10x my money and that is why it is a big portfolio. It's a big position in my portfolio. Inspect has made me a lot of money in the past few days and shout out to them. Next, we have HyperCycle. HyperCycle is another good cryptocurrency that I hold and it's actually done really well since I invested in it because I also invested in the um, pre-launch price of about five and a half cents and now it's at 70 cents. So I also basically 15 x my money with HyperCycle and it made me a good amount of money as well. Now, Space Chain. This is one that a lot of you have been asking me about. A lot of people have been asking me if I still own Space Chain. And the short answer is yes, I still own Space Chain because 
as the name suggests, Space Chain is a cryptocurrency that is trying to open up space for everyone. And no other cryptocurrency is doing what Space Chain is doing, okay? So it is in a league of its own. And now to my AI cryptocurrencies, because Singularity DAO is a project that I'm invested in because of Singularity Net. Singularity Net to AGIX is a leading AI cryptocurrency project trying to build a decentralized ecosystem of AI applications that we can all use in our daily lives. Now, Singularity Net is a top leading AI project. There are other good ones, yes, but I believe Singularity Net is unique in of its own. And Singularity DAO is a certain project built on top of Singularity Net, which is this other crypto project. So they are connected. Now, Singularity DAO gives you access to cryptocurrencies early on, like HyperCycle, for example. And that's how I invested in HyperCycle at five cents is by owning and staking my Singularity DAO tokens on their official website. So that's why I own Singularity DAO and Singularity Net also is a top AI cryptocurrency that you definitely need to look into as well. But that is why I say that all of these projects that we covered in today's video from Singularity DAO, Space Chain, HyperCycle, Inspect, Hedera HBAR, Stellar Lumens, XLM, XRP, Quant QNT, and USDC. I know that's a long list, but that's why I say that those 10 can make us a lot of money in the next born. And at least that's why I own them. Don't forget to smash the like button, leave a comment down below because I want to hear from all of you and I will see y'all very soon. Mr. Mufle, out.